Hey everybody, welcome back to Nems Plays EU4, where I am Milan, and we're now in Ambrosian Republic, and all that fun stuff. I still don't have sea tiles, that's kind of depressing. Uh, we did finally core Mantua, which is good. Now our estates, the burgers want a province. Alright, so what province shall we give them? Um, trade power wise, who's good? Um... 4.8, 4.2, 7.2, probably Cremona. Hmm. 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 Trade value. Uh, we could give a Mantua. Uh, why not? There you go. Now you should be happy. Extra trade efficiency is fun. Let's give them some extra loyalty. That'll be good. Uh, and then call it. A, a, there we go. And now everybody's happy. And that'll help us from a monetary perspective, at least for a little while. Meanwhile, let's take our army maintenance back down to zero. And we should have all of our forts already mothballed. We do. Okay. So making five ducats a uh, a month is actually really good. And uh, let's move our troops, though, back off the border, uh, just in case uh, Venice gets froggy. Mm -hmm. uh, gain a stability and lose some tradition. Or gain tradition. Uh, right now, I'm going to take the tradition. Because I really need to get that up as soon as possible. Alright, meanwhile, uh, that's a thing. Uh, we are going to improve relations with uh, Savoy. We're still a ways off from uh, France, so we're going to pause on them. It's, these guys are still way off because of other issues. Um, I mean, I could go the Aragon path, but that would likely lead me to war with France, and, well, that just sounds like a bad idea. Uh, Bohemia is still out there. They might be a not bad option. Burgundy, if we want to abandon the France plan and the Austria plan, but that just seems like a bad idea right now. And then, uh, there's still Provence. Provence not the worst of ideas. Let's improve with Provence and see what happens. Yeah, we can get up speed four for a little bit here. Kind of need Venice to go fight somebody. I'm not feeling like we could take them right this second. Um, because that's sixteen thousand troops just from their two allies is all we have, and right now uh, we don't have a ton of favors yet. Uh, Lucca wants to be my ally. Well, that's an interesting proposition. They are allied with Genoa. And that's it. Uh, no, I'm going to decline. Sorry, Lucca. I actually ought to... Um, I actually ought to fabricate on you myself. Let's do that, actually. Uh, that's not what I want. Build Spy Network. Because that would allow us, um, that would allow us to get to the sea. And that would be a big deal. I mean, we still have a bit of aggressive expansion to burn off, but it uh, wouldn't hurt to start building a spy network now. I'm going to keep Savoy happy. Luckily, that uh, St. Ambrose Republic is going to burn off over time. Uh, do we want to go ahead and boost stability? Ooh, that's so much. Just because we don't have Republican tradition right now. I'm probably going to hold off for now. We're just going to hang out at negative stability. I'm going to go ahead and turn this on, though. Just in case... Just in case the Mantuan Separatists uh, fire. Advancement of the clergy. They gain some influence. Shouldn't be a big deal. Oh, the Renaissance. All right. Um, did we get the Renaissance? 
Gain a hundred of each power, twenty prestige. And Mantua is the birthplace of the rest. Sweet. I've never been uh, in very limited playthroughs, obviously. I have never been the birth of uh, one of these things. And I think that's awesome. So we can embrace this institution for 200 ducats. And I think that we're probably going to do that. Though, what's the uh, speed at which they're embracing? Um, yeah, I'm probably just going to spend the money. Yeah, that's how we do it. And yes, we'll take military or tech, and uh, we'll also take diplotech because that gives us better trade efficiency, which is fantastic. All right, so um, not awesome. Uh, so let's look at uh, where is it? Uh, economic, yeah, institutions. Boom, birthplace of the Renaissance. Now. If we look at the institutions, the next one will be, uh, what, colonialism? We will not be the first there. Because uh, that's a new world thing, and we're not going to do that. Okay. Uh, do we want to hire an advisor? Uh, yeah, discipline, please. Early on, I really just want to make sure we keep uh, pace with military tech as much as humanly possible. That is my primary goal. All right, so um, let's go ahead and get our uh, claim on Lucka. And are we doing okay? I think we're doing okay there. So I'm gonna pull back here. And do we wanna go back to France? Neutral attitude is part of what's killing us. Maybe we should be friendly to France. Uh, it's pretty friendly. We like France. France is so wonderful. The rival to Aragon, Burgundy, and England. Switzerland, you sons of... Never mind. Um, uh, yeah, I'll take military power for ducats. That's a, that's a pretty low price for military points, to be quite honest with you. Um, we could build a spy network in, um, Switzerland. And it's actually not a bad idea to build spy networks in your surrounding countries to help reduce the impact of, uh, um, uh, aggressive expansion. This thing here, which has our, yeah. People have noticed that we took other people's stuff. That's a thing. Alright, so we've maxed out with Savoy. That's good. Um, we're doing pretty good with Florence. Um, we're going to pick a new guy again. Uh, Tech-wise, what do we need? We still need, really, admin tech. But we're getting close. And I'm probably going to stay with a military candidate. Uh, what is our election cycle? Uh, where is that? I don't see. Alright, so we're going to get a new candidate. Um, I'll go ahead and do bureaucrat for now. Just so we can catch up on tech and get a little ahead there. Because uh, I do need to start getting to my ideas. Oh, nice. He's a free thinker, so minus 5% idea cost. That could come in handy. Um, Do I want to boost this now? I kind of think it's time to boost. Uh, but man, 164 points. It's just... I just, uh, I can't. I just can't. I can't even. Mm hmm. Oh, yeah, I'm not royally married to this guy anymore, am I? So I'm only down to. I'm down to two relations because I'm not married to France or Austria. So. Pope is not interested. Hungary is not interested. They're definitely not interested. 
Uh, Bohemia might not be a bad idea. Let's go ahead and start improving with Bohemia. And then with Switzerland down, um, could look at Baden. They're only allied to Ulm. That's kind of problematic. Um, hmm. All right, there goes Aragon. Bye, Aragon. Venice just rivaled us. That's a problem. So Aragon is now in a PU under Castile. So do I want to get plus one prestige for the next 40 years and lose... Oh, boy. Um, uh, I like prestige. That's the problem. 40 prestige is a lot of prestige. But do I want to give... Yeah, I might as well. It's a long-term investment. I understand that. What's uh? What do we like at full? And eh, we're close. Okay, let's um. Who are our rivals again? Let's take care of some basics here. Switzerland. Uh, is it Ferrara? Yeah, Switzerland, Ferrara, and Venice. So, let's uh embargo these guys. Uh, embargo these guys. And embargo these guys. Alright, good. I'm going to wait a minute, though. So I have at least a little bit of a buffer in uh, in admin points built up, just in case we need to, um, uh, you know, do some things with uh, stability. Alright, trade efficiency up. Born spy detection down. That is what it is. Uh, Genoa, you're still allied to Austria. Lucca. Who declared war on you? Who would fight Gelray, Utrecht, Genoa. Hmm. And we could bring in Florence and Savoy, but we would have to offer them land. And I don't really know that I want to give them land. We are getting close on favors, though. In fact, you should help me no matter what. Really? Oh, they're fighting in another war. Okay, okay. Uh, Provence wants to hire Condottieri. Who are they fighting? Burgundy, Nevers, Brabant, Flanders, Holland, and Brittany. That's the war that Savoy is in. So, um, what would you, how much would you be willing to pay? Um, 1.2. Hmm. Yeah, why not? All right, so who are you fighting? Burgundy and all of his buddies. Okay. So. Venice has embraced the Renaissance. Fair enough. Where are my friends? Oh, they're all over in Brittany. Okay. We'll head over to Brittany then. They're thinking about coming in on us. They're thinking real hard. Oh no. Oh yeah, yeah, that's good. Savoy hired French troops. That's actually very good. Yeah, I'm just gonna do some some sieges. Sieges are good. Good help fight, no. Yep, we're going to help fight anyway. Not sure what they were doing there. Uh, let's break this down to speed three. All right. We'll go fight these guys. We should be able to beat them handily. Oh, wait, that's Provence. Derp and derp. So we'll get, uh, we'll get Brittany out of the war here. 
All right, we're gonna help. We're helping. Hopefully we're helping enough and not losing a stupid amount of men. And that's a lot of reinforcements that we've got coming here. Uh, we did win though, that's good. All right, let's go siege down some more land. Yeah, that's a lot more men than I was hoping to lose. All right, we'll do that. And uh, I think it's time. All right. I don't think I want to do anything too much more than that because uh, manpower is a precious resource and Venice will eventually try to kill me. And it's just going to happen. This is a horrible general to roll. I'm kind of upset about it. Spent 50 freaking military points on that guy. Meanwhile, though, the war seems to be doing well. Whose war is this, anyway? It is the uh, Burgundian Provincial Excommunication War. So they're trying to excommunicate Provence. Uh, Burgundy rented out Swiss troops. Ooh, yeah, there's lots of stuff afoot down there. Hopefully the French are turning the tide, though. And once we get Brittany out of the war, um, that'll be less troops we're dealing with. I'll go ahead and kick it up speed four for a minute so we can get some of these sieges done. Man. <laughs> Damn Brittany forts, man. They're no joke. Or we roll that bad. It's probably, it's probably that we roll that bad. Ferrara is no longer a valid rival. I wonder why. Hmm. Cardinal Minister. Either we get some stuff or we gain some prestige. Um, Let's see. 20 years of extra missionary, papal, tolerance, stability cost. Nah, I'll take the prestige. And then I got to revoke the embargo on them. And then we are going to need to eventually rival somebody else. All right. Yes, I will ally with Bohemia. <laughs> All right, we're at 35%. They're at 36%. Uh, it is time once again to select a new candidate, but now that we have this, uh, I'm going to go ahead and go back to military. And in fact, um, I may want to... Uh, trade efficiency minus 10. You're killing me! Burgundy killing me. All right, the Burgundians are doing damage down there. Uh, the French are trying to... Oh, nice. Francesco Sforza, the Duke of Milan, founded the Cagranda Hospital in 1456 as one of the first community hospitals. It was designed by Antonio Filarete and was one of the first buildings done in the Renaissance style in Lombardia. The Duke did this to gain the affection of the people of Annunciata. We get 10 Republican tradition, which is awesome. <coughs> Excuse me. We gain a stability. Awesome. Base tax. Awesome. Base manpower. Amazing. So we just got two free development and a bunch of other stuff for clicking the button. Winning. All right, we're at 0%, but we're going to have to break the siege if we want to keep these guys alive. And, uh, yep, that's a thing. Siege of Nantes is over, so we'll let them go siege that down. We'll re-siege this province. Uh, our manpower is getting a little bit low now, so um, we got to be very careful on what we're doing here. Uh, meanwhile, France is just running around trying to stop on some people. Uh, it may be time for me to shift down through France. Why am I stuck here? Okay, did that war just end? It did. 
All right, go home, guys. So what happened there? Did uh, oh no, um, Provence just pieced out, didn't they? Nope, I'm an idiot, and I've Brittany pieced out, <laughs> and I'm not paying attention at all. Need to find France. There we go. Save me, France. Can we beat this Nevers guys up? Yeah, we can. What in the world? I have no idea what that was. All right. Our condottieri has been canceled. The war has ended, and it cost us a whole lot, honestly. It was a very costly war. Yeah, we can't do any of this stuff for obvious reasons. Uh, temple. Temple sounds great in Milan. Thank you. Or is it better to do this? Uh, I'm going to do the temple first. And I'm actually going to do a few temples because that's almost a duck in a month uh, between all that. All right. Well, that was fun. Um, what that basically allowed us to do was burn off a decent amount of this. So if you look at us now, we have pretty much almost no aggressive expansion, which will lead to this thing happening soon. Uh, Florence would help us. Savoy is in debt, so they can't help us right now, but they will. Uh, and we'll be fighting Genoa, Utrecht, and Gelra along with Lucca. So come back next episode as we uh, hopefully find our way to the coast. I've been Ems. If you're enjoying the series, please leave a like down below. If you haven't already, comment, and uh, we'll see you next episode. Bye, everybody.